A warm welcome back to another Foxy Games UK news video. If you like the work I do here, go ahead, like, subscribe, hit notification, follow Foxy Games UK via Twitter at foxygames underscore UK for more informative gaming news, rumor, opinion, and gameplay. So, in our fourth Pico 4 VR and Pico 4 VR games showcase, Moss Book 2. And is it a beautiful game? A tale, no pun intended, a tale of a valiant mouse sword in hand fighting to save a kingdom. Moss Book 2 is a winner of many game awards including Best VR and AR Game. Uh, the VR Game Awards gave it the VR Game of the Year and many more awards. Moss Book 2 is the award-winning sequel to the fan-favorite VR game Moss and has secured a spot on multiple essential and must-play lists. Book 2 is a single-player action-adventure puzzle game from Polyarc, tailor-made for VR. It combines a classic component of great games such as compelling characters, gripping combat and captivating world exploration with the exciting opportunities presented in virtual reality. This game is literally a fairy tale and you're the reader. So Moss Book 2 picks up right up where the story in the prequel Moss left off having rescued really her uncle Argus. Quill's adventure continues with the revelation that a winged tyrant is hunting her within the castle where her uncle was held captive. But Quill has a plan of her own, one that could finally end the merciless rule of the arcane and save the world from a great unmaking. So the journey will be trying, filled with triumph and heartbreak alike. But new allies, old friends and the very nature of the castle itself can offer help along the way. Yet in the end, it is you alone who can lift Quill up to save the world and together rise to the legend. So in terms of gameplay, well, your every action has even more meaning in Moss Book 2, as you can take full advantage of today's virtual reality technology and it really looks astonishingly good on Pico 4. It's been released on other platforms with obviously greater capabilities than Pico 4, but it really does capture the essence and very little has been downgraded in terms of the port to Pico 4. So you'll be moving many objects, battle enemies and manipulate the field of play as the key ally to the hero Quill. You are literally reading a book, a storybook, and it's all playing out before you as if you are some omnipotent all-seeing eye. Yes, Moss Book 2 truly is a fairy tale for the ages. You'll travel back to a lively world that hums with wonder and legend, explore the castle where her uncle was held captive, caves beneath, snow-covered mountain tops to the depths below filled with ancient artifacts, mysterious creatures and sprawling views. Your abilities are complementary to Quill's in an alliance for the ages. Combine classic action adventure controls in a world that responds to your every touch. You'll be solving puzzles, combat evil and achieve victory together. It's a story told unlike any before. From its opening pages, Moss Book 2 continues to draw you in into its first of its kind, fully immersive world of myth and magic. Enjoy a rich tale of intriguing characters, illustrious artifacts and legends old and new and it really is amazing i mean i was playing it and completely mesmerized and there are quite a few puzzles in this game but they're not really that taxing common sense prevails as you can see here moving these stone artifacts and it allows the gate to open so i can get to the next uh, screen or level and you meet lots of characters it's fully voiced it runs very smoothly um Unfortunately, with many of these standalone VR headsets, I would say the foveated rendering is a touch strong in this one because you literally have to stay directly at, in focus at anything on the screen and around it, it's just pixelated, but it's not too immersion breaking. And you even get that with uh, the more powerful VR headsets that actually require hardware like a PC or a console. So you get that in all guises, but naturally with these standalone units there's only so much you can expect them to do i mean all the hardware as i say is packed in to the head unit which is a miracle in itself it's absolutely fantastic i love vr i love pico 4 i'm really enjoying using the product 
sound effects are fantastic as you'd expect and the music is just mesmerizing it's really whimsical uh, wind in the willows feel i love the characters they're so well animated and the the character models are surprisingly good thing with vr is right the closer you move your head uh, forward is the closer you get to images that you can see here on the screen you're not quite getting the viewpoint i'm getting the perspective i'm getting but i did do my best to really zoom in by moving my head forward and looking at things in great detail so as to get a you know a bit of a feel of how good this game is made um absolutely love this game i would recommend this game to absolutely anyone it's, it's really doing well scoring well everywhere websites that uh, accommodate vr gaming i haven't played moss book one so i don't really want to get too far into this because i'd rather start from scratch and play as a continual story you know continuity is everything in this business but yeah look at the game look at this game it's absolutely fan dabber docious if you have a pico 4 headset this is the one you should really start off with because it really does go easy on those people who are not quite used to vr sometimes you jump into these really uh, sort of uh, exciting but overwhelming vr experiences for the first time and you can suffer motion sickness this game is so relaxing that you control everything where you look it's not super fast paced and you still got control like a normal video game with the the thumbsticks but you're using your head to look around and obviously grasping stuff in vr with the controllers fantastic game really if i was to review the game i'd give it an easy easy eight out of ten on pico 4 so there you have it moss book two everybody a game that plays extremely well on pico 4 vr definitely a keeper though what say you let's continue the discussion cordially in the comments as that brings us to the end of the video just like subscribe hit the notification bell comment regularly on videos you can help reach more gamers so feel free to share the video you may also want to consider supporting to foxy games uk via patreon because well we're like family now link in the description but that concludes our time together play games not corporations